Hi, my name is Kevin Hall, CEO of Global Integration. We are specialists in matrix management, virtual teams and global working. In this video, I'm going to talk about the increased importance of working with external partners around the world. As work and business processes become more horizontal, they cut across the traditional, functional and geographic silos in organisations and often lead to the introduction of a matrix organisation or an increase in virtual and global working. In many cases, work extends beyond the traditional organisational boundaries to include third parties. Three of the most common forms of this are global account management, where customers insist on a single point of contact, but success relies on engaging multiple stakeholders in both organisations. Secondly, outsourcing or offshoring, which involves managing the delicate process of transition and then building the capability to manage a more remote relationship which may cross distance, cultures and time zones and where most communication is through technology. Thirdly, complex supply chains where we become increasingly integrated with and dependent on our partners and the traditional organisational boundaries become less relevant to the delivery of work. All of these extend the need for effective matrix, virtual and global working outside the traditional boundaries and control of the single organisation. However, this requires the capability to work effectively with external partners. Typical symptoms of problems in this area can include a lack of trust between the partners, micromanagement of the relationship by the customer, clashes of corporate culture in different ways of working, high levels of escalation of problems and an inability to get the best out of each other in managing change and innovation. We've worked with organisations and their external partners around the world to build teams and solve problems in the way people work together with their external partners. This could involve working with both parties in an outsourcing or offshoring environment to prepare, transition and manage a more remote style of management, building virtual teams that incorporate members from two or more organisations who need to work together on a project or activity, or identifying and working on specific problems in the relationships between two organisations which are often a combination of corporate cultural differences, ways of working and commercial considerations. We also help clients build an open corporate culture that's easier for others to cooperate with. Many organisations invest substantially in common IT systems to connect them with their partners, but it's equally important to develop an open and shared way of working to get the best out of this form of cooperation. Each of our working with external partners programmes is unique. It depends on your precise mix of challenges and cultures and any constraints you face in engaging with other organisations. If you need to work more effectively with your customers, suppliers or critical business partners, why not speak to one of our specialists about your particular needs? We have existing intellectual property in all of these areas and can quickly put together a programme based around your specific situation. If you'd like to keep up to date with our videos, podcasts and other resources on working in complex companies, please join one of our social networks. In the meantime, I wish you good luck and I hope you found this video useful. Thank you.